My name is Laura Flynn, and I live in Waltham. I live in the same house that I was born in 56 years ago. I've had many meaningful relationships along the way. Probably one of the most important things is that in one of my marriages, I had two children who are now adults, who are 22 and 23 years old. One has graduated from college, completing her master's degree, and one is a senior in studying art at UMass Lowell. And I'm very proud that I've been able to do that by myself. In 1972, when we graduated from Waltham High, I went to Middlesex Community College and got my associate's degree in dental hygiene. I practiced in dentistry for 25 years. I left dentistry 10 years ago to become a fitness director. One of my greatest passions is that I'm a, re I'm a registered yoga teacher. I've been working at the Waltham YMCA for 20 years and I acquired a position at Carlton Willard Village in Bedford, which is a long-term care facility. It's called Continuing Care Retirement Community and I'm the fitness director there. I remember how much I wanted to leave St. Mary's High to go to Waltham High. My mother wouldn't let me leave St. Mary's until January of our sophomore year and I was just itching to get out of there. So I remember my arrival at school in the dead of winter and being completely blown away by how big it was compared to St. Mary's. After about my first week of classes, I realized this is a little bit too hard for me. I think I'll drop down a C2, which I very quickly did and got into classes with all my friends and all the party people. And for the next two, next two and a half years, that's what I did. I always loved going to the football games and the basketball games. I hung with a crowd of friends, my girlfriends from St. Mary's. We were referred to as F Troop. We traveled the city of Waltham in a pack. I remember the school dances and how much fun they were. And one event was, I was lured out of my English class and met another student in the foyer of where the auditoriums were and this person kissed me in the hallway and I, I couldn't believe that such a thing was happening at school. My how things have changed. Another thing I remember very clearly about Waltham High was the smoking in the bathrooms. I never smoked and I was just horrified that you would go in a bathroom and that's what people were in there doing. <laughs> I had a blast in Mr. Prohovich's class. It just so happened that I was one of the few girls and I was new kid on the block, St. Mary's girl. And it just so happened that I knew the vocabulary a little bit better than the basketball players that sat near me. So they would sort of sit kind of close to me at test time. I think we always dreaded our housemaster. Oh, who was that teacher? The guy that taught office machines. And Mr. Capucci in the typewriting class. Mary Brown and myself got kicked out of class because we were talking and fooling around in typewriting class. But of course, neither of us were business majors. You know, this is a really wonderful event. Uh, there were four of us that pulled this off starting three weeks ago in just great email communications, Facebook communications. It would be awesome if we could all continue to communicate and be in touch. We are planning a 40th reunion in two years. We'd love to hear from you and be able to get a good mailing list or however we'll choose to do that. Maybe we'll do it by email this time. Uh, Jim Donnelly's done a wonderful job creating a website for our class that will stay up and running for the next two and a half years. So please do that. We'll be happy to see you.